Welcome back to my kitchen. I'm Santo and the recipe that I'm going to show today is ABC Halwa. I'm very happy today because I received a lot of emails from my close friends and all of your emails were very motivating. Thank you very much. Today I'm going to show you how to make ABC Halwa. A for apples, B for banana and C for carrot. Isn't it sounding interesting? Yes it is. And we all know carrot is a halwa material. We all love carrot halwa. And apple and banana are also two flavorful fruits. This is a very interesting recipe. Try it and I'm sure you'll love it. The ingredients for this recipe are 1 cup of apple cut into pieces 1 cup of banana cut into pieces 1 cup of shredded carrot 2 cups of sugar 1 cup of shredded coconut 3 fourth cup of ghee little cardamom powder and a cup of milk To remember the ingredients for this recipe is very easy All you need to do is just remember that 1 cup of apple, banana, carrot 1 cup of milk, 1 cup of coconut and just the sugar, make it 2 times and ghee, 3 fourth cup a little pinch of cardamom The first step is I'm going to grind carrot and milk together in a blender I'll see you soon after I finish blending this Go! I blended the carrot and milk together in a blender and now the mixture is ready now we'll see how to start making the halwa. I'm going to take a thick bottom kadai, the carrot mixture. Banana and apple. I'm going to give this a mix and immediately add the coconut mixture also into this. important thing to remember when making halwa is the, the bottom of the vessel has to be very thick so that the halwa does not get burnt up and also we are going to add the sugar only at the last when all of the ingredients is cooked very well this is because once the sugar is added the rest of the ingredients will not cook properly I'll see you back after five minutes since the halwa gets thicker till then I'm gonna keep stirring this now it's been about five minutes and as you see the milk has started to reduce there is no more milk at this stage we want to add our two cups of sugar into this mixture I'm going to give it a nice stir look at the color it's looking very nice and the kitchen is smelling very nice because of the apple and the banana now I'm going to wait for another 2 minutes till this sugar syrup also gets nicely incorporated with this halwa the kitchen is smelling wonderful the smell of banana and apple is is really nice about 7 minutes and look at the halwa it's almost ready if, if we if we do like this with our spatula, the surface has to be clean. So this is the stage when everything is becoming a mass and our alva is almost going to get ready. We are going to keep this in the stove for another 2 minutes and then add our cardamom powder and ghee and with that the alva will be ready. Now the halwa is ready. 3 4 cup of butter to this, of ghee to this. Wow, it's smelling fantastic. Cardamom powder. The alba is ready. Let me transfer this into a plate. My halwa is ready. I have transferred this into a plate. It's smelling very nice and it's looking very tempting. I'm going to offer this to the Lord and then have this as prashadam. It's a very, very tasty recipe. 
try this halwa at home and i'm sure you'll like it thank you very much for watching my video